Client Review and Sign. Once you send a request for an electronic signature from a client, the client receives an email from the tax preparer that is signed into the connected service. This email includes a link that provides your client with secure and encrypted access to their tax documents. To view the documents you shared, your client will need to click the View Documents button in their email. Note that your client can access and sign your documents from any device and will not need to download or install any software to do so. The first security measure is for your client to enter their mailing address. After entering this information, your client will be prompted to answer three questions. These questions are provided on behalf of DocuSign by LexisNexis Risk Solutions, a leader in fraud prevention and identity management solutions. The questions are generated randomly from information available through public records and credit reports. This is also known as Dynamic Knowledge-Based Authentication, or Dynamic KBA, an IRS and federal agency requirement for electronic signatures on the 8879 and similar forms. This information does not come from Intuit and is not shared, sold, or published with anyone, including the tax preparer. Once your client completes the questionnaire, they'll read through the consent information, check the electronic consent checkbox, and click Review Document to view the documents you shared for them for signing. The 8879 will appear and they will click the yellow Start button on the left. Next, they'll enter their electronic signature. They can choose from multiple font choices or draw their own signature. Once they've selected their signature choice, they will click the yellow Confirm Signing button. This completes their part of the e-signature process. Once completed, your client will close the e-signature window and will receive an automated, completed e-signature email. They can use the link in this email to save a copy of their signed 8879 for their records.